Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. 740 is your time. There are millions of people suffering from high cholesterol, but here in Austin, there is a new treatment for it. Dr. Robert Hookins is with the Austin Diagnostic Clinic. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for Well, inviting. tell us about this new treatment, apheresis, it's called. That's correct. Uh, it's called lipid apheresis. Uh, it's a new technique to, to extract the bad cholesterol out of the body, the, the low-density lipoprotein, LDL. Historically, we've tried to use medications for people that have hypercholesterolemia. Yeah. And sometimes the medicines will get you to target. Uh, sometimes they don't. And there are some genetic diseases that cause people to have very high levels of cholesterol. And as a consequence, early in life, they can have strokes and heart attacks. Uh, and even their longevity is not very good. So when the medicines fail, uh, we have another technique now that's uh, not too unlike dialysis. It's a technique that involves extracting the plasma uh, from the blood and running it through two columns that specifically uh, attach to the LDL molecule and pull the LDL out of your system and return everything back. So it's very selective. It only takes the bad cholesterol out of your system and we can get cholesterol levels down with one treatment about 75 percent. Huh. And the average patient needs this treatment about every two weeks to keep the levels low. How high does your cholesterol have to be in order to qualify for the treatment? Well, you have to have an LDL level of 200 or greater with known cardiac disease on maximal therapy or 300 or greater if, you, if it's not known that you have cardiac disease. Wow, that sounds mind-boggling. <laughs> it is, Almost, these are very high levels. Yeah, wow. <laughs> now, if some of the cholesterol is a genetic, then is there anything else that you can do to prevent high cholesterol if it, if it is genetic? Uh, in these families that have a genetic disorder, being able to extract the LDL out of their system, uh, there really is nothing else currently that can be utilized. The, the most powerful medicines that we have, which are the statin medicines, in most cases will drop people's levels from 40 to 60 percent. Huh. But even at a 60 percent uh, level reduction, these individuals still have levels that could be three, four, five hundred or greater. Yeah. And there, there's a number of people that actually have some side effects on statins. So even though most of us can tolerate them, not everybody does. And sometimes uh, we don't even have that pharmaceutical approach to trying to lower their cholesterol. Well, if you'd like to make an appointment with Dr. Hookins, you can do that by calling 901-4010, or you can visit their website at adclinic.com. Don't be afraid of his voice. He's a very nice man. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs>